Hi, this is your lucky sir. We got this paper, JE Main 2022 Phase 2, 25th evening session. Thank you, Akash, for providing this paper. Choose the correct answer. Which of the following is correct decreasing order of acidity? Very easy question. Phenol's acidic nature is increased by NO2 groups at para is best. So option B is best. Then A. OCH3 group is plus M group at para. OCH3 is minus I at uh, meta position. So the right answer is BACD. Okay. Clear solutions are given. Uh, here CH3, CH2, CN, CH3, MGBR. So first step after hydrolysis you are getting there. Butanone. Okay. 2 butanone is formed. 2 butanone on zinc HD HCl means Clemens and reduction. So butane first option. Okay. So butanone is formed. Butanone is converted to butane. Clemens and reduction. Which of the following is the correct order of first ionization energy? Very, very simple question. Basic level question. Nitrogen is more than oxygen, half full stability, beryllium more than boron, full full stability. So right option is nitrogen, oxygen, beryllium, boron. Fourth option. One to glycosidic linkage is present in which biomolecule? So when you are looking at this paper, try to remember these kind of questions. One to glycosidic linkage is present in sucrose. No logic. Okay, no. there is no need. Even if you want some logic, you need to remember the structure. The site occupied by inhibitor which changes the shape of the active site is called. Okay, that site is called allosteric site because of that the structure, the shape is changed so that it won't be attacked. The correct order of density of the following elements. Morning session, sodium potassium exception was there. Now the exception is beryllium magnesium. Actually, up to calcium decreases then increases. So calcium is the least then magnesium, then beryllium, then strontium. So this is a very good exception taken as it is from NCRT. Which of the following is correct order of acidic strength? This is a good question. Okay, see, CO2 is acidic, N2 and N2 are neutral. So you will get definitely some confusion about this. BrO4 minus is the base of strong acid. So it is the weakest acid. BrO4 minus, strongest is CO2. If this is the given option, then fourth is right. In that NO, N2O, based on oxidation state also, you can say NO is better. But NO, N2O, both are neutral actually. Okay, neutral oxides when we are taking, we consider them. This is a good question. This is simple. Find the relation between Ka1, Ka2, Ka3. First one proton gone. Second another proton gone. In the overall reaction, two protons gone. So Ka3 is equal to K1 into K2. Simple chemical equilibrium question that is. Match the following, nylon 66 is used for bristles of brush, low density polythene is for toys, high density polythene is for buckets, teflon is for non-stick utensils, polymers, memory, no logic. These type of questions are very common from the coordination chemistry. Nickel with two, uh, that should be three actually, NIEN taken thrice, NINS3 taken six, NIH2 taken six. The printing mistake it is, it should be three, NIEN3. So that is better. A is better than B, better than C. Stronger the ligand and uh, more bridging, then that will be much better. Okay. So CFAC order A, B, C, last option. Which of the following option represent the correct order? This is a very good question actually. See both sides there is an alpha hydrogen. So you need to check the alpha hydrogen from where it can be gone, carbon ion formation, then you need to take all these structures. It is time taking, but option one will come. Okay. You know all the products, how to write the other products, that is easy job. But here you need some time because when both sides groups are there and four options are given, you need to check very carefully. See, this is the solution. OH minus is taking the proton. CH2 minus carbon ion is formed that is attacking another molecule that is converted to OH. All the condensation questions are very regular questions. Which of the following option represents the correct product of the following reaction? This is again a very good question. Left side you see C double bond O group is there, so anti Marconic of addition takes place. Electron withdrawing group is there. And right side you see oxygen is present, that's why a proton shift will be taking place, and finally you will be getting there bromine at this place. Okay, so option 2 should be the right answer. Option 2. What happened here? Left hand side, anti Markovnikov because of C double bond group. Right hand side, proton shift because of oxygen lone pair. 
the structure. This is the mechanism. No need of this much mechanism. Simply you can remember. Nicotine. Nicotine is pesticide sulfates for laxative effect. Fluoride is harmful for bones. Sodium arsenate is herbicides. Again, memory based in this may kuch logic ki koi zarurati nahi hai. Aap yaad rakhenge to aajayega. Hydrogen, pure hydrogen can be prepared from barium hydroxide. This is given as it is statement in NCRT book. Okay. So, electrolysis of warm solution of barium hydroxide, you will be getting the 99.9% is pure. Which of the following contain all the correct match of compounds? This is one simple question actually. XeOO4 is SP3D2. Okay, this is wrong. XeO3 SP3 is correct. XeO6 is SP3D3 is right. XeO2 F2 is SP3D correct. So, simple hybridization concepts, you know, half into central atom valency plus monovalent atoms attached. If you use that one, that will be very easy. Half into xenon valency 8, monovalent 4, 8 plus 4 by 2, that is 6. 6 means SP3D2. So, first one gone. Second, XeO3, 1 by 2 into 8, 4, 4 means SP3. Okay, this is the data. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 questions are not known as this is a memory based paper. We will check the remaining. Find the sum of the lo total loan pairs in the following compounds XeF6, xenon 1 loan pair, 6 fluorines each 3. So, total 19. XeOF4, xenon will be having 1 loan pair, oxygen 2 loan pairs, and 4 fluorines are there each 3. 15 XeO3. 1 xenon with 1 lone pair, 3 oxygen with 2 lone pairs each, total 41 lone pairs. And when this kind of questions are there, you see carefully whether the lone pairs in the molecule they are asking are central atom. Okay, you must be very careful about this. How many of the following oxides are acidic oxides? Here NO, NO is neutral, N2O is neutral, P4 protein is acidic, B2O3 is acidic, N2O5 is acidic, CO is basic. Okay. Metal oxides are basic, non-metal oxides are acidic, NO, N2O, CO are special, they are neutral. This is interesting. An electron in the fourth excited state in hydrogen atom, when it jumps to ground state, the to find the total number, maximum number of wavelength, if they are asking, this is not the answer. Okay, now I think they asked about how many lines are found. Answer 10 is given. Fourth excited state means that is 5. Okay, now fourth excited means that is fifth level. 5th level to 1st level means difference is 4, 5 minus 1, 4. So, total number of lines whenever this is asked, we were discussing in the previous papers also, 4 difference is there, 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1, 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1, 4 lines in Lyman series, 3 in Balmer, 2 passion, 1 bracket. So, total 10 lines will be there. Find the molar ratio of gas present in two different containers having same volume. Container 1 at 47 degrees Celsius, container 2 at 447 degrees Celsius. So, here same pressure, same volume is there. So, N1 T1 is equal to N2 T2. This is the formula. Direct calculation 2.25 you are getting. For a first order reaction, the following graph is given and he is asking half life of the reaction is K in 10 power of minus 5. What is the value of K? This is little time taking. You need to go through with this one log p by p naught is equals minus kt by 2.303 and after that half life of first order reaction is equal to 0 0.693 by k time taking you just check whether you can solve it or not but the formula you remember that's enough 